up, YouTube? This is Jazz bringing you another episode of Pokemon Diamond Variety. In the last episode, we got to Pokemon, the Pokemon League, and now we're going to start off this, off this venture to battle the Pokemon League. Well, anyway, I am going to think I'm going to kill my team any way I can. And the next battle is not going to be against an Elite Four member, but a... But, um, but a rival barrier, whoever, Tyson. That's the default name is Barry. I don't think I gave the other rival a default name in Black 2, so... Because Hugh just seemed appropriate. I am quite a bit uh, quite a bit higher than him. The problem is we don't have a fighting, I just realized. We're going to be in trouble here. But I think we're going to start off with Naruto because he'll lead with Star Raptor. I know some of the uh, abilities. The only one I don't really know is Flash Fire. Hold on a second, I'll be right back. Okay, uh, I know what Flash Fire does now. It, like, the first time at least when it's hit by a, if put one with the ability is hit by a fire move, then its fire moves are up by, like, a fifth, I think. Let's get going. Hold it! Don't go off without me! You're challenging the Pokemon League, aren't you? That's why I'm here too! Let's see who's more worthy of making the challenge of a battle! This- now the speed is way too fast, but it's a pretty catchy tune. Now Star Raptor, before we go into it, Star Raptor obviously is level 48. It's a normal fly Pokemon. It has the ability Intimidate, which halves your attack. So you gotta be careful, which I think I'll have to be careful because I think the electric move I have is a physical. Has the moves, close combat, which is a fighting move, so I have to watch out for that with Naruto. Has aerial ice, which is a stab flying. It has steel wing, which is a steel attack, and it has U-turn, which is a bug attack. With U-turn, you gotta watch out the fact that once it uses U-turn, it could switch to another team member. I've learned that from the other episode of Put One Black 2. So, I'm a little bit in trouble here. Hmm. I think the best thing to do would be the charm, to lower its. Wait, 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 buddy. Y you could have done any move. Close combat, yet you don't. Well, that's not bad, but you know what? I think I'll go for one more charm. So make it close combat enough next to nothing. Come do it super thing. Yeah, now that that just that just did nothing now because of my charm. Yeah, go Naruto! Toratera. He's a grass and ground type. Mmm. Shit. Mmm. No, oh, you're probably gonna kill me for this. Because Torterra is a grass round type with the ability overgrow, which means when Torterra is at a tight situation, like its last little bit of HP, it will double, I think, or power up grass type moves. And it has the moves Leaf Storm, which is a special 5 PP grass move. Has Earthquake, a physical ground move, with a power, I think, of a 120, I think. It has Crunch, which is a dark-type move, which the ch with chance to flinch, and Synthesis, which is a status, or which is a, like, a some type of status grass move, which will heal the HP, depending on the weather. Whether it's sunny, it does more if it's sunny. So... Mmm... Um, Try to decide which is... I think what I'm going to do right now is I am going to check the stats. A higher um, attack than special attack. Okay. 
and the Slayer Blitz is 120 and it does damage to itself. So boy. So that means uh, we're gonna have to go for Flare Blitz. Good. I'm losing some HP, but that's good. Floatsy, all right. We're going to go to Naruto again. Swim Seal is a water type, level 40 knot. It has the ability Swift Spit Swim, which raises its speed in rain. And it has the moves Aqua Jet, Ice Fang, Crunch, and Brick Break. Aqua Jet goes first, and it's a very low water attack, but it goes first. And Ice Fang, well, that's one reason I switched to Naruto rather than Emily. Because it has ice coverage for grass moves. Brick Break is a fighting type physical move. Which may be a little deadly, but that's why I'm. Spark! Oh! But Crutch again has a chance to flinch, so. Snorlax! This is the one I'm worried about the most. By far. Ugh. I don't think I have much coverage at all. Not much at all. Jeez. I think I'm gonna have to... Uh, what? Level 51? Why is he at level 51? I'm switching. Hmm. What? Yep. Yeah. Oh, forgot. Jeez, I forgot to tell you, but before we go any further, Snorlax is a normal type Pokemon level 51 with the ability immunity, which means it can't be poisoned. And it has the moves Rest, Crunch, Earthquake, and Body Slam, like you saw. Body Slam has a chance to paralyze the. Pokemon. Rest recovers like it's half its HP, I believe. Earthquake is obviously, you know, a strong move. Snorlax is known for his attack. Good. Like, Rest he would have put him to sleep, but it would have recovered his HP. Heracross! Alright, Heracross is a bug flying Pokemon. It's level 50, has the ability score which doubles its bug type attacks, I think, when it's at low HP, and it has the moves Mega Horn, Close Combat, Night Slash, and Aerial Ace. Mega Horn and Close Combat are stab moves. Night Slash, I believe it's recycled, but I think Mega Horn would have done well for that too. And Aerial Ace, I don't really know. Mm. Although I still don't know why he's level 51. I'm gonna have to fix this up soon. Alright. Uh, I don't think I need much. Goodbye. Alright, Rapidash! He has a Rapidash himself! So, it has Flash Fire, which, as I said, if it's hit by a Fire-type attack, it'll raise its fire. A bit like cat. It has the moves Will O Wisp, Sunny Day, Bounce, and Fire Blast. Will O Wisp will burn the Pokemon that it's targeted at. Sunny Day will raise fire type moves. Bounce is a fly move, kind of similar to fly. It brings it up in the air and he brings it down to attack. And Fire Blast is its stab fire move, which is like with Sunny Day, it is deadly. Really deadly. But I'm not planning to use a fire move. I believe in the last one. Really? Oh crap. No, oh, it can paralyze. I never knew that. That's something I gotta be careful for. Alright, well, I'm gonna pause it and get the other guy back to level 75. I don't know what happened. Okay, guys, I feel stupid. I forgot that Nyx was my HM slave. Yeah, it happens. 
Mm, I never healed the Pokemon or not. I never. But I'm going to go and um open up my. So I'm going to take on one member of the Elite Four before I end off the episode. Yeah, I got all the... Why are you confirming that I am ready if I go to 6-3 mode? What do they ex... Blah, 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 blah. Like, I understand. Alright. Alright. Going to send out Pegasus first. Hello, welcome to the Pokemon League. I'm Aaron of the Elite Four. It is good to meet you. Oh, I should explain. I'm a huge fan of both Pokemon. I'm not so much of a fan. Both Pokemon are nasty, mean, and yet they're beautiful too. Uh, well, I suppose that you could kind of say that, but I think they're more nasty, mean. Would you like to know why I take our challengers here in this room? It's because I want to become perfect, just like my bug Pokemon. Okay, let's let me take you on. Become perfect? Skill lead with dust stops. Level 53 with the move Shield Dust, which eliminates extra effects. It has the moves Tossic, Bug Buzz, Double Team, and Light Screen. Double Team and Light Screen are used like as defense tactics. Light Screen to raise its team's special defense. And Double Team to raise its evasion. It'll use Tossic to annoy ya and give you get you badly poisoned and bug buzz as its stab special move. It's best just to try to knock it out right away, because it can still be as is it's not high moves as it has, it's still annoying. Alright, it's going to send out Thespi Queen, which I believe is his ace. I don't know, maybe not. You would think, though, it would be his ace, but... No, it's level 54, a bug flying, with the ability pressure, which it removes two instead of one PP from a move you use. It has attack order, defend order, heal order, and power gem. Attack order, I think, raises its attack. Oh no, attack order is a, bu a bug attack, but it, I think it doubles depending on the Pokemon in your team. Then order adds defense, heal order heals you, and power gem is a rock type move, special move. So, it's a little dangerous for Pegasus to be out, but mm, I'm gonna flare blitz right now. Don't want to get it. I'm back, but anyway, wait, wait. Hair cross, like I said with Fairy, is a bug fighting type. It has the ability swarm like Fairy, which will raise its bug attack if it's in a sitch. It has the moves Mega Horn, Close Combat Night, Night Slash, and Stone Edge, that's the only difference between berries and its besides level. Stone Edge is dangerous against fire type Pokemon or flying. So it has that edge. Mega Horn is stabbed. Post Combat is stabbed. Night Slash. Again, I really don't know with the Mega Horn why they even need it. Important to get that one out of the way though too. And I can't heal. Oh shit. Drapion, now that is its ace. It's level 57 Poison Dark type with move Battle Armor, which, jeez, I forget now what it does, but it has X Scissor, Cross, Poison, Ice Fang, and Aerial Ace, all which are kind of dangerous. Mm. I think I'm going to send out Loopy for this. Earthquake is probably the best bet for Drapion. Oh, and I'm going to yawn. What? Oh. Beautiful eye. 
Oops, I forgot to say about Drapion, but I think he had, Drapion had X, Scissor, Cross, Poison, Ice Fang, and Aerialist. Yeah, I think I did. Beautifly! Beautifly is a bug fighting, it has Swarm, it has the moves Energy Ball, Bug Buzz, Psychic, and Shadow Ball. So it has a pretty good, um, type coverage. Shadow Ball, I'm not so sure about why I needed Psychic. I need defeat. Blah, blah, blah. I apologize, I can not read that. I lost with the most beautiful and toughest of the bug Pokemon. We lost because I wasn't good enough. That's it. Back to training camp. Let's hear it for me. No, well, anyway. Street trainers are waiting for you. They're all tougher than me. Alright, guys. In the next episode, we're taking on, I believe, Bertha? I don't know, but I'll see you in the next episode of Pokemon Diamond Variety, right? I'll see you next time.